The hundreds of Gonzaga students, faculty, and fans, they have made the trek to Phoenix to witness history. The campus is also getting ready to watch. KXY4's Caroline Rourke is there as the campus prepares for the Final Four. Caroline? Nadine, you know, I've heard of so many students and faculty members making the trip down to Phoenix that I half expected Gonzaga's campus to be a ghost town today when I was there. Rest assured, it is not. There are still plenty of fans here ready to bring the noise for their favorite team. At first glance, it seems like a normal Friday at Gonzaga, but signs of the campus-wide excitement for tomorrow's game are everywhere. It's, it's an exciting, exciting time for Gonzaga. Hundreds of their classmates and professors are in Phoenix. Many of these students wish they were too. I mean, I wish I could go. It's a pretty amazing experience to be like there for Final Four. The first time that we're there is pretty exciting. Classes were not officially canceled today, though students tried. The students have to make that decision. What's, what's more important, and, uh, and some of them definitely decided a different route than class. Some professors, though, giving in to popular demand. One of econ professors, he actually is a huge Zag fan and has canceled class on both Friday and Monday. For everyone still in Spokane, these Zags are ready to bring just as much spirit to the Hemmingson Center. We're expecting quite a few people, a hundred possibly thousands of people. I watch all the videos and people go crazy, it's so cool. <laughs> The GU community is known for its pride, but students say it's reached a new level this basketball season. Usually it's like big, huge schools like UCLA and Duke that go to the Final Four. And so it's just awesome to actually be respected and be like, we're a tiny school, but we have so much pride and we're finally going to get here. It's not just because we have spirit, it's because we actually have talent too. So whether it's in Phoenix or Spokane, Zag Nation will be in full force. Now, the folks at Gonzaga's Hemmingson Center told me today that they plan to use all three of the building's floors for tomorrow's game watch. We will, of course, be there, so be sure to check out all of our social media tomorrow for all things Gonzaga. Reporting live from Gonzaga University tonight, Caroline Rourke, KXOY4 News. Thanks, Caroline.